Hotty toddy everybody, this is Tommy again with Colonel Reb Scale Models coming at you with yes, another entry for our group build. It's just getting out of control guys. But this one I wanted to do simply because it's a young builder who just started posting modeling videos. He's had some videos of himself fishing and some outdoor stuff which he seems like he's a pretty good fisherman. Um, I think I'm going to have to go check out his video on his homemade brim bait. That should be interesting. Anyway, uh, you know, I always try to support the young guys because that's the future of the hobby. Um, you know, and it's, it's good to see some young folks getting involved. So I think it's kind of our duty almost to um, get behind them, help support them, you know, support their channels. And he's thrown out a video of uh, a group build that's going on now and he said a couple of months so either October or November I don't know if the beginning of October or the beginning of November but anyway gives us you know gives you some time to get in there um, you know I, I, I saw found his channel through uh, Panzerman Bill um, just like I did with uh, uh, young Jim Parashakis on his Italian front group bill which yes I know I know I'm still got to work on it um, anyway uh, so this is what, you know, I, I, I thought about it and, you know, I was like, well, I got too much going on. There's no way. But then I remembered I had this little kit. It's a, it's a L45 Bofors 37 millimeter anti-tank gun that was used in the North Africa campaign. And I thought about building this back when I first got into the, the, the community for uh, Russell Goslin's uh, North Africa group build, but then, you know, things just kind of fell by the wayside. So, you know, I'm looking at this kit. I knew I had it from, mean, you know, many years ago, like the rest of them. It's a Tom kit, 135th scale. It's not a lot of pieces, as you can see. I mean, you know, you've got, it's got small pieces, so, but, you know, all this stuff I've been building lately has been kind of teeny tiny. So, you know, not a lot of, uh, not a lot of pieces. That's the instruction sheet, as you can see, just one little easy page, so to speak. And what I thought was kind of interesting about this one, it actually has little little rubber tires. So this one's actually broke, but you know he'll fit over there, and you just glue him back. You know, so this one should not take very long to put together. There is a little bit of flash on it. Um, and like I said, I mean, some of the pieces are very tiny. It uh, doesn't come with any figures. It's just the gun. So I'll probably just set it on a base, you know, like a sand base kind of thing since it's from North Africa. And, you know, just kind of dust it up a little bit, make it dirty from the desert. Just a brand light tan kind of paint scheme. Not a lot to it. Maybe try to, you know, simulate the leather on the seat. Uh, if I come across any figures, you know, that that are out there, I might pick those up, but at, at this point, I doubt it. So, anyway, uh, his channel, again, is, his name is Ryan Christner, like Christ, N-E-R. Um, so, if you can, just check him out. He's posted a few videos. Um, I think it's just important for us to support him again. You know, any of the new builders we see come online, uh, you know, do what we can to support them. And, again, I know... Panzerman Bill is getting the word out, so I'm hoping there's more people joining in. Um, like I said, it's a few months that you have that you can build, and you know I just want to support him, his channel, and even though this is kind of a small build, I do, did have one little problem, fellas. That's the end of my barrel. It got brokey. So I'll just have to get that one glued together and go on from there. But anyway, fellas, that's it. That's my entry for Ryan Christner's British vehicle, plane, tank, armor, what have you. That was, uh, I'm assuming it's just limited to World War II. Maybe it's, maybe it's any war. Or maybe it's any British vehicle of all time. I'm not really sure now that I think about it. But anyway, this is my entry. So, like I said, if you can, uh, check out his channel. Sub if you can. Support him. And if you can, if you got time, if you got a kit, jump on in the group build. All right? As always, fellas, 
keep those styrene dreams alive keep building keep sharing hotty toddy and god bless